my name is Sarah. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if you're new here. Today is an exciting video. It's my SAS wish list. I know a lot of my friends um, have posted tips and tricks. I'll tag a bunch of them down below so you guys can go find tips and tricks for SAS. Um, but I'm not doing a tips and tricks video because I've been in this game for like six years and honestly I know how I shop the sale and I do it my own way. A lot of the things that my friends say online is so true and like they're already saying it so I'm like I'm not gonna just you know repeat what they're saying I'm just gonna like do my thing and tell you guys to listen to them. So this is just a wish list. Um, this is summer 2023 SAS so excited I haven't been posting on YouTube this will be my first video in a while in like two weeks because I moved so it's been a lot lately I'm just like still getting used to things also I don't have wi-fi currently so I haven't been able to post anything like I want to post this tier ranking video which will be after this video probably it's a little late but I took forever it took me forever to edit that video so I'm still gonna post it but yeah so this is my SIS wish list. We are so excited. Voila, and then this side. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you hit subscribe. And if you're not already, check out my Beth Marks Instagram. I'll post it right here. Uh, hauls, empties, collections, you name it, it's all on there. Username is linked down below. Not linked, but it's down below. So yeah, let's just get into the video. I wrote this list before I did some research on the scents, meaning watching my friends talk about scents. I mostly watch Leah's video and like she does like super early reviews on things because she gets access to scents that we don't get access to right away because she knows people. I wish I was that close to my sales associates. Um, but yeah, so I watched her videos last night and then I have some edits to make. But I'm going to go over my SAS like wish list. Like I want to get these. And then I have a maybe smell list because I don't know if I love this scents. And I'm not going to say like I want these because if it turns out I don't like them, I'm not going to get them. So we're going to go over the main things first. And the first thing I put on here is for my boyfriend. It is the fresh water shower gel. He actually likes this one. And I feel like whenever your man tells you that he likes a scent, it's like, oh, I need to like, you're telling me you like this. So I need to get you this. So I'm going to maybe get, I'm going to, for sure one, but maybe two, and maybe save the other one for, like, later. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get those. And then, watermelon mojito. I have so much watermelon. Um, I'll go into groovy watermelon later, but I really want watermelon mojito. I really don't need it. I don't need any summer shower gels, if we're being really honest, but, like, I'm a collector, so I'm gonna have a lot. It just is what it is. Um, so I want a watermelon, watermelon mojito shower gel and two lotions, because I have a watermelon lemonade lo shower gel that's a loner doesn't have a friend so maybe I'll put that lotion with that one and I'm not gonna really talk about prices but I know that those are gonna be like $3.95 and I'm like maybe I should just get $3.95 or just wait till it goes like 75% off I don't know it's like if I don't get anything like I don't really want to get anything 50% off like I just don't I did last year but if it's really if I just don't get it it's not meant to be some of these scents that I want will come back later so yeah next like this one cotton candy clouds I want to spray in that I have uh, two sets in it. I think, yeah, two sets except I'm missing a little spray. So I just want a full size. I love that scent. And, you know, if I don't get it, it will come back next year or, you know, in two years, whatever. It's going to come back eventually. And I want to spray it at a full size spray. Next is the Gingham Fresh Lotion. So that one, I don't even know if it's going to be on sale. I don't know. But I want a lotion because I have um, two shower gels now in it and I have mini spray and I don't have a lotion. So I'm like, may as well just get the lotion. Okay. Next is apparently Moonlight Path and a few other scents are leaving. So if Moonlight Path is leaving, maybe I'll get a shower gel or like a mini in it. Um, I used to like that scent back when I started collecting, I had like three in it. I had like the spray, the lotion and the shower gel all in minis. And I got tired of that really quickly. And that was back in like 2016. So I feel like for nostalgia purposes, I would want to get a shower gel, but it's not the end of it, but I don't. And then next is Pure Wonder and You're the Wonder Going Away. I feel like they're just going to repackage them. Like, I don't know. Part of me is like, yeah, they could very much well be going away and then they bring them out like a year later or something. But I heard they're going away. And that makes me sad because I love those scents. So I want to get a set of each maybe but if they're repackaging it that's so dumb so only if it's 75% off I'm not gonna get uh you're the one that's 50% off or actually I might get you're the one over pure wonder because I have so much pure wonder right now over you're the one so but yeah next oh okay so this is that was all body care I'll talk about more body care on the smell list but 
The other things that I would definitely want are the pistachio ice cream candle, maybe two. I remember loving that scent back in like 2018, 2017, 2018 or 2019, not 2017, 2018 or 2019, whenever it came out. I remember loving that scent and that's when I used to like go nose blind to my wallflowers really fast and I only got into wallflower because I never used um, candles. So I just know I love that, that's candle and that, that wallflower, whatever. I love that scent. So I want to get two and they're like $15. So if I can find those 75% off, I'll get them. If not, it's not a big deal. I don't need that badly. It's only a single wick. So, okay. And then the PB&J candles, kind of a question mark, same with mint chocolate ch chip ice cream because, or milkshake. I mean, those are going to be hard to find since they're the limited ones. I don't know. We'll see about those. And then I need a new hand sanitizer holder. I don't have anything wrong with my hand sanitizer holder. It's a unicorn, but she's kind of old. So maybe I'll get a new one. All right. This list is kind of long. It's my maybe smell list. Maybe smell this. Um, I've already smelled this, but Poolside Cabana um, smells pretty good. It's, I don't know, like I already smelled it and it was good. I don't know if I want it really badly. If I get anything in it, it's going to be like a lotion. So I don't need a shower gels, shower jellies. Next is the Gingham Gorgeous, like a mini. It's either going to be a, you know, any mini form. Actually, I was going to say shower gel or spray, but I'm down to get like just a lotion in it. I go through mini shower gels faster than mini lotions. So, um, but yeah, something mini in that, if I can find that 75% off would be nice. I still haven't smelled Calm Haven. I think it's like lavender and iris. I could be totally wrong on that, but that smells, that seems like it smells good. And jasmine eucalyptus, I think I would like that too, because it has jasmine. But if the eucalyptus is too overpowering, then no thanks. Those two are aromatherapy. So I'm not so sure if I even like those, because I don't really get aromatherapy. If I do, it's only the black chamomile and they don't even have that anymore. They'll bring it back sometime. Okay, next is Cactus Blossom. Okay, so I like Cactus Blossom in Home Fragrance. I have a wallflower and I had a soap blaster in it and I love the soap. But I remember when this, this came out, I'm so bad at yours. See, I, I have it in my head because I post on Instagram about it. Pretty sure it was 2019 or 2018. Like, I just remember it being like then. You know, COVID like totally separates collections for me. But then like 2019 and 2018 kind of like cut kind of like blend together and so did 2016 2017 but i'm pretty sure that was 2019 if i'm wrong i'm wrong i remember not liking that in like when i smelled it in lotion and shower gel so i'm gonna smell it and if i like it i'll get it because i do really like it in the soap I'm like oh home fragrance okay next is central amber i don't remember like this scent i don't even know if it was a, like i was a collector then but if it smells anything like cashmere glow even though there's no cashmere yet, um it's just the packaging looks like it. And then I like amber scents though. So I don't know. I know it's a throwback. So like they had that scent before. It's not in the throwback sense, but it's, they've had that before. I feel like, I don't know if I like it though. It's a maybe smell list. Okay. Next are the retired scents. So I don't like cucumber melon. Not looking forward to that. I don't remember if I liked Tumeria. I think in 2015 when they brought those back, like I said, don't remember the exact years. I don't think I like that. Um, I'm going to maybe try to smell white tea and ginger. It's not white tea and sage. It's white tea and ginger, I'm really sure. I don't know. And then Juniper Breeze, um, there's a girl on YouTube that really likes that one. So I'm going to try to smell that one too. And, hmm, I wanted Freesia to come back because my mom loved that scent, I guess, like back in the day. But I don't think it's coming back. There was a rumor that it was going to come back. It just had like the list. But then we got pictures of these ones and not Freesia. So I wanted to get Freesia for my mom though. But if they don't have it, they don't have it, you know? Okay, next is Fruity Sherbert. So I don't know what this is going to smell like. Actually, Leah said it kind of smells like tart candy. Um, I wrote in my notes that I would not, I would only get a shower gel or a spray, no lotion in that because, oh, that collection, same with whipped coconut milkshake, doesn't have, um, what's it called? They don't have lotions in that. They only have body creams. And not on my list is the orange one. No, that's in a different collection. What scent? Oh yeah, Cotton Candy has another scent. Okay, yeah, whatever. I didn't talk about um, Sunset Glow and the orange scent because I don't like oranges. And Sunset Glow, I know a lot of people love Sunset Glow. It's just like, okay. Like, I don't like dislike it, but I'm just like, it's not like something I want to go buy and like have backups and backups and backups. Okay, next is, so yeah, Shruti Sherberry, totally a shower gel or spray, if I actually like it. And then Whipped Coconut Milkshake, a maybe. I feel like Bath and Works is coconut's best friend, and I feel like they just do a lot of coconuts, so we'll see if I like that. Again, there's no lotion in that collection, so I'd have to get a shower gel or spray. 
Next is Groovy Watermelon. So I am wrote this down before I watched Leah's video and I just found out and Bonnie talked about this too. I watched hers last night. Um, it's just like Watermelon Blast from last year and I know that got such a rave. I just like kind of got tired of that scent because I have that scent and it's good. Except I brought it on vacation with me last year and now that scent just reminds me of vacation and I have a full-size body cream, full-size shower gel, and a full-size spray paint this and that. So I don't really want it. It's cute packaging. So if you like Groovy Watermelon, you go get yourself some Groovy Watermelon. It's Pink Watermelon Blast apparently. So I don't think I'm going to get that. So I will probably cross that off my list. Next is Disco Daydream. I thought this was going to be a grape scent because it's purple. No, it's a coconut scent. But I also haven't smelled it. So I'm going to still smell it. Um, there's like a weird scent note in the beginning that people don't know what it smells like. I wouldn't know how it smells like either. But I'm really excited to smell that one. Next we have Rainbow Waves. Thought that sounded cool, but apparently that was last year's Love is Win Love Always Wins scent. So I don't think I'm gonna like it because it's citrusy. Bath Water Works, what are you doing? Make a pride collection with all the colors. I'm gonna keep saying that every freaking June because I think that's gonna be a good seller. They always just make one scent. It's like why? Just make a whole pride collection. Do the whole rainbow. It's not that hard. Then everyone can pick their favorite color of scent they like. You know, I don't know. Just something. And then next is Golden Sunflower. Apparently we've had that before. So I'm going to smell it. I don't know if I liked it because I obviously don't have it. So we'll smell it. Then we have Endless Sea, Wild Sand, and Under Oasis. Underwater Oasis. Don't know if I like any of those. We'll smell them. I feel like Endless Sea and Underwater Oasis are going to be like stuff I don't really go towards. But Wild Sand probably has some kind of like wowing note that I'll probably like. I don't know. But yeah, that is my list. I'm so excited for SAS. I wore yellow specifically. Not specifically for this video, but specifically. I keep saying specifically. I wore yellow today because SAS is yellow and red, but also yellow. So yeah, that was my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, comment down below what you're most lucky looking forward to at the sale, like your number one item. I guess my number one item would have to be Cotton Candle House Spray. I know that's so generic. Like not generic, but like expected. I don't know. But that's probably what my number one thing is. If I really like Fruity Schubert, I feel like that's going to be really good too. But yeah, I hope you guys have a great shopping. I can't believe it's in a week and I wasn't going to film this. And then I realized it's next weekend. It's next weekend, June 3rd. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you in my next video. You'll probably see the cheering video next. I'll probably put a little disclaimer before that video. Like this is kind of old because some of the scents might be, you know, because I don't know when no one's going to be posted. But yeah, you'll see that next. I hope you guys enjoy. Duh. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.